All right, this is going to be a quick little guide slash walkthrough for the um, box gun manip uh, shoot library level. Yeah, so uh, for the manip itself, what we're going to do is just uh, hold escape and restart. And then for the manip, we're going to do S and F, which are my walk backwards and melee keys. Um, and I'm going to hold right click, which is my throw grenade. And then I'm going to click last checkpoint. Yes. So we should melee, throw the grenade, and walk backwards. And then that will get us the box gun. So that is very simple. And then this box gun can be used to bump ourselves into various places. So we're going to do that. So let's do, I'll do that one more time. And then let's do a little run with those. So sorry, Johnson, we're going to be skipping you for the majority of the run and taking the fast route. So this first door, there is a trigger in front of this door here. Um, if you go too fast, you can miss it, so I usually just walk through that section. Uh, for these, I'm aiming uh, this little circle here. Um, so I want to shoot one at the bottom of the circle, and then I'll shoot one at the top of the circle. And then once I do that, I'm going to like look towards the boxes and just tap W. And that should push me into the wall. And this is the, the trick we're going to be doing for the majority of the run is do the lineup, shoot two boxes, and um, clip, the, clip through the door. So since we don't have the hog, one of the challenges is we have to keep being speedy uh, with the blunderbuss. And you have a pretty l like relatively limited amount of ammo with the blunderbuss. It definitely goes quickly. You only get 20, well, 21 shots because you have one in the chamber. So 21 shots total. So we hopefully will be able to pick some up along the way. There are two spots I will show you that you can generally get ammo, but it's not, I don't think it's guaranteed. It's just a, a pretty good odds. Um, this elevator, we're going to wait for the cutscene text to come up and stay up for a second, and then we're going to do a double jump. That should bring us right up here. Skips a little bit of the elevator. And then we're just gonna we're just gonna keep progressing here. So another door. Uh, shoot one there, one there. Bump, and we're through. Um, so going that way is probably faster, if but you'll use more ammo. So it's kind of a, a trade-off of. Do I want to risk using more ammo, or do I want to play it a little safer? But um, for this run, I'm going to play it a little safer. That's fucking abysmal. I hate this gun. <laughs> okay. Well, I don't think we actually even saved any ammo there. I'm just going to jump through this door. Um, yep, and then we'll go through the tunnel. One of those guys can have a, a shotgun. This guy might. No, he's got a regular. Okay, one of them did actually have a the blunderbuss. But yeah, they, they can spawn with the blunderbuss or the, the bent shotgun. Uh, which does not share ammo. They're separate pools. But there should be a guy up here that will shoot us, and what happens is he flies up and then falls to his death. 
So if you can keep an eye on him, you should be able to pick up his ammo uh, a good majority of the time. So now we're back at uh, full 21. And that should supply us for the rest of the run. Hopefully. Um, it depends how um, cavalier you are with your shotgun shots and how how many you screw up because this thing is is just wild as far as sometimes it just randomly shoots the inner direction so this elevator we're gonna do the same thing we're gonna wait for the cutscene text to come up for about a second or not Hold on, I thought there was, um... Okay, well, I guess there's not cutscene text there. I, I could have sworn there was. Maybe I skipped a trigger or something. So that guy's got a, a bent shotgun. You can tell because the blunderbuss is absolutely loud. Just ear-piercing. Scoop by these guys, let him explode. I got hit by it anyways, okay. Um, this guy might have a... yep, he had a motor bus. So I, I would not depend on that spawn specifically at all. It, that was just RNG. Sometimes you get guys that have it. So we're at Dark Door. Uh, this guy is in the way. Unfortunately, a couple of these guys are in the way. I'm going to try to do this pretty quickly. Okay. So I'll put up some um, screenshots of the door uh, where you need to shoot the boxes as well. Oops, I have ramped up. Unfortunate. Yeah, it can be kind of sketchy because the blunderbuss does damage you, so... Yeah, that was a, a mistake. <laughs> so, okay, we did not... We did not crash here. That's always good. Should get a checkpoint. You should get a pretty copious amount of checkpoints taking this route just because you're skipping so much. Um, I shot the wrong location there, but it's okay. We made it through anyways. So yeah, you, when you do the boxes, you want to shoot closer first and then go outwards from you. Um, because what's essentially happening is we're, we're creating like a little chain of... of teleports so we're, we're gonna be inside one box and then we're gonna put like one more ahead of that so that we're like just inside the second box and then a little more inside the the closer one so it, we kind of like do a little chain teleport kind of thingy um, yeah I thought there was um cutscene text for these. Maybe I'm, I'm skipping a trigger somewhere and I've, I've bricked the level or something, but I don't know. So this door, same thing. It's just uh, every, every door has a little bit different lineup. But um, it's it's very hard to screw up, as long as when you when you put the boxes down, you just tap W. If you hold W, you're gonna jiggle around and screw it up. So don't do that. You just want a little just a little boom tap. Like don't don't like don't like one tick tap it, but like you know just a you know, little little input. And here we are at the last door. So 
this is where the quiz is. Yep. We're going to be skipping that entirely. And if everything went right, we should end the level. Yeah, we did. So, yeah. That is the library with the box gun. That is far more enjoyable than having to babysit uh, Johnson and the, the Warthog and all that. So it will definitely make this level one, faster, and two, more enjoyable. So that's it. Yeah. Um, have fun.